Mexican gray wolves are the rarest and most genetically unique subspecies of gray wolf in the world. In the United States, only one reintroduced population of Mexican gray wolves exists in Arizona and New Mexico. They are a federally protected endangered species under the Endangered Species Act. Wolves are family-oriented, social animals. Our landscapes evolved with these top predators playing an important role. They help create a strong and healthy ecosystem and bring balance to nature. Let's make sure they are given the chance. In order for the new management rules to further the long-term conservation of the Mexican gray wolf in the wild, we encourage you to submit a comment to the newly proposed changes to the 10J rule on the Mexican gray wolf reintroduction project. Mexican gray wolves belong in the Grand Canyon ecoregion and the Southern Rockies. Wolves should not be removed from the wild because they roam beyond any geographic boundary. And in particular, wolves should not be removed from the wild for traveling into or inhabiting regions north of Interstate 40. The U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service needs to establish two additional core populations north of Interstate 40 to provide for full recovery of the species. Wolves need freedom from boundaries. Given room to roam, the wolves will establish themselves in suitable areas with adequate prey. The U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service must be proactive in support of wolves to establish new packs and populations in additional areas. Capturing and containing wolves is always a risky business that can result in stress, injury, or even death of these rare animals. The U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service must include measurable genetic standards for assuring progress toward recovery benchmarks based on the best available science and resume the releases of well-bonded wolf families. The population objective for long-term recovery at 320 wolves is way too low. The new rules must first and foremost further the long-term conservation of the endangered subspecies. The restrictions on killing and removing wolves from the wild should be made permanent. Wild Mexican wolves need increased legal protections under the Endangered Species Act. The only reintroduced population in the United States should be considered essential instead of non-essential under Section 10J. Wolves once lived throughout Arizona and New Mexico and played a critical role in keeping the balance of nature in place. We need to restore this important animal that has been missing for far too long.